Party, how many terms of the Taylor polynomial are needed to approximate values of the function f of x equals natural log of 1 minus x with an error less than 10 to the negative third on the interval negative 1 half and 1 half? So we are going to find n such that the absolute value of the rn less than 10 to the negative third for x between negative one half and one half. From part A, we get the Rn in the form of negative x to the power n plus one divided by n plus one times one minus c to the power n plus one. So we take the absolute value and this expression less than two to the negative three. Note that c is between x and a. a is the center, a is zero, and x is the number between negative one half and one half. Or you can draw the real number line as zero as a center, and x cover from negative one half to one half. Now we are going to choose the quantity c that give the smallest denominator. We're gonna choose c equals one half, and also choose x that will give the largest denominator. So we're gonna use x equals one half. Then this expression on the left-hand side will be the absolute value of negative one half to the power n plus one. Or we can ignore the negative side. So we have one half to the power n plus one divided by n plus one, multiplied by one minus one half to the power n plus one, less than 10 to the negative third. So we can reduce one half to the n plus one and one minus one half to the n plus one since they are the same quantity. And we get the left hand side as one over n plus one, less than 10 to the negative third. And solve this inequality, we get n plus one greater than 10 to the third, which is a thousand. So n will be strictly greater than a thousand plus one or 1001. No, minus one. So we get n greater than a thousand minus one or 999. So we're going to need at least a thousand n equals So n going to be strictly greater than 1,000 minus 1 or 999. That means at least we need n equals 1,000 as the order of the Taylor polynomial approximation to control the error to be less than 10 to the negative third. 